ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, welcome to the first webisode of DFTV, Dirt Farmer Television. This is going to be an ongoing series of tutorials on how to pay your farm bill. Uh, we're going to start today with some basics. Uh, this is going to be a short, sweet episode, webisode, uh, just to go over some of the basics. Uh, for beginners, these are going to be really helpful hints. For veterans, uh, bear with me uh, because you probably already know all this stuff. Who knows? You may not know a few of them, and you may be able to uh, catch some things that I might have missed and send me some uh, emails letting me know what I need to add to the next webisode. <clears throat> Let's start with a very basic question. How do you tell how many Farmville neighbors you have? Well, there's one way. You can go to the neighbor icon, uh, the neighbor tab, uh, look in there, and, and basically it's not going to tell you anything. Uh, you, At some point, you've probably asked someone to go in there and look for you to tell you how many neighbors you had. There's an easy way. Right here at the ribbons, click on ribbons. Your first ribbon, local celebrity, is going to tell you you have, well, actually this is mine, 299 neighbors. Uh, yours will tell you how many neighbors you have obviously uh, real simple technique uh, to figure out how many neighbors you have here's another question I get asked all the time what does the nursery make uh, let's pull it down real simple uh, all the ponies turn into these blue ponies uh, all the minis turn into these cream mini horses all the uh, cream drafts, uh, the first runs, a few other ones will turn into the cream draft horse right here. And everything else will turn into a black horse. That's the way it was designed to make it. If you notice that I've got X amount of cream draft, X amount of black horses, X amount of minis, these are called ready mares. Uh, these, the Brown and the gray are what I call first tier ready mares. The uh, cream draft, the black, and the minis are second tier ready mares. They're just used for stable stuffing, which we'll get into later. Uh, there have been a few glitches which allow you to make a lot of red horses, a lot of red pinto horses. There was a, a white Mustang that was out there, and I, I, I started a third tier of ready mares. Again, the black paint horse did the same thing. And there were a few others where we just got multiples of that I use for basically breeder stock. And like I said, that will be a future tutorial. Now, what does your nursery make? Look inside. It tells you. Put the icon over the foal or the calf. And like I told you before, the cream mini foal produces a cream mini horse. Here's an oddball. Uh, this is actually what I call a nursery glitch uh, foal. Uh, it will make its adult version. The smitten foal makes a smitten stallion. Uh, so if you need a stallion you don't want to pay for one, find a smitten foal. Uh, batwing foal produces, still produces the Batwing horse. Uh, the Lunar New Year foal produces the Lunar New Year horse. And there are a few others. You can find them by going to uh, the Dirt Farmer blog. And we've got a list of not only um, the uh, nursery glitch foals and calves that grow into their adult cells, but also something called a brown list. Uh, and we'll get into that a little later also. Uh, this has been webisode number one. And it was short, it was sweet, but I need to test this software uh, for this uh, video capture device. Uh, so it's going to remain short and sweet. Have a great day. Thanks.